the Emperor of Lucha Libre. Santos Escobar, a cruiserweight who creates controversy. The following contest is a triple threat match and is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Introducing the challenger, representing Legado del Fantasma from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 200 pounds, Santos Escobar. Well, after months of mysterious abductions and attacks in the NXT parking lot, nobody suspected El Hijo del Fantasma. El Hijo del Fantasma couldn't do that. Santos Escobar did it. Elite lucha skill, but proved that he's a mastermind too. Raul Mendoza, Joaquin Wild reaching new heights under Escobar. Chad Gable, big opportunity here tonight. And introducing the champion, representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds. He is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Chad Gable. Former Olympian, former NXT Tag Team Champion, SmackDown Live Tag Team Champion, one of the most self-assured superstars you will see in the WWE. the challenger representing the new day from Ghana West Africa weighing in at 212 pounds Kofi Kingston you look at the resume of Kofi Kingston and everything he's accomplished but you cannot forget when Kofi Mania ran wild at Wrestlemania and Kofi Kingston became the WWE champion it cemented Kofi's legacy Byron Surefire first ballot Hall of Famer, Kofi Kingston, the real deal. If you don't believe human beings can fly, Kofi Kingston is happy to prove you wrong. Hey, if you've got to compete against Kofi Kingston, expect the unexpected because Kofi is always going to bring it. Considered by many as the hardest working champion in all of sports entertainment. Athletes with an insatiable drive to become the Intercontinental Champion facing off in this triple threat matchup. This will be on a swivel in this one with Santos Escobar, Chad Gable, and Kofi Kingston. Remember, the champion doesn't have to be part of the decision to lose the title. And the champ can't be happy knowing that the title could be lost, not due to any fault of their own. Double chicken wing, tiger suplex. Oh, the back of the net. Set by oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. You know, I have to ask Corey, how much of an actual strategy is there in a disqualification match? Honestly, it depends on the superstar's mindset. Some just want to get through it. Others want to inflict as much damage as possible, and some just go with the flow. Know which mindset you have before the match and stick to it. Great reaction from Kofi. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Back and forth from these competitors. Gable sent flying. Inelegant exit, but if it works, it works. And he's taking this to the outside now. 
Watch this Herculean power. Deadlift back suplex. He returns to the ring. The stomp in every single part of his body. Oh, oh, look at it. Take it out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Take down. <laughs> Helicopter spin. This is ridiculous. This is insulting. This is entertaining. Challenger eating up some damage. Drop kick hits hard, lands harder. Suplex. The springboard attack fails to land. Jawbreaker. Call it down. Kick gets caught. Uh-oh, 
helpful. Able to reverse that one. What are we going to see here? Oh, neck breaker. Winning this title means to give everything you've got. I don't know how much. changed hands. Yeah, and we had the distinct pleasure of having the best seats in the house, gentlemen.